Well, the rain was in the forecast here at Anfield, and whoever predicted it got it spot on. No change on the weather front. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Liverpool up against Tottenham Hotspur. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent. Oh, he's through on goal here, Derek. And there it is! The opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, let's have another look at this pass from Thiago. He has so much vision, and what an emphatic strike it is from Salah. Hit with his laces, it's a great finish and a great goal. Underway once more, Liverpool have the lead. Alexander-Arnold. And a no-nonsense clearance. Can they take advantage? And take it away. Jota. Gakpo. Rebier. And now with Kulusevsky on the offensive. Gives it a go. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Poor pass. A slide rule pass. And the keeper more than equal to the task. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Well, they're creating chances. They now just need to take one of them. Mind you, what a save that was. Well, attacks are plenty, but now... Do it was a terrible looking challenge and a big decision for the official here well to be honest I'm not sure what possessed him to put in a challenge like that in the first place well it's dangerous it's reckless it's out of control it's a red card all day long He's got to have a go here, and a goal almost bewitching in its beauty, excellent technique. Well, let's see this again, because that's a fantastic bit of technique. To get that much movement and accuracy on the strike needs the perfect contact on the ball, and he's certainly got that. What a free kick that is. The ball is moving again. Trent the owner of the silver hatchback with the license plate GR55 J. And unable to keep possession. Contact the nearest security guard. Thank you. Shot up. Kulusevsky. Couldn't keep it. 
Henderson. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Henderson. Well, we're shortly going to hear the half-time whistle. It's Liverpool on top, and Stuart, they've been impressive. Well, from an attacking point of view, it's been a very good performance. I've really liked the way they've got the ball from back to front, then how the forwards have got away from their markers, and the speed of their attacks as well. It's been a really impressive first half. Taking it away. Kulusevski. And played the pass well. And a chance to whip it in here. He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. And that brings to an end the first half here at Anfield. Well, he's normally the ultimate team player, Hyung Min Son, but for whatever reason, it hasn't happened for him. Well, Derek, he has to impose himself on this game. He's been far too quiet so far. If they are to get back into this, he needs to make something happen and start getting some shots away. So into the second half, and I must say it was a spellbinding performance by Liverpool in the first 45 here. Advantage, Spurs. Diogo Jota. And they deal with the threat this time. Henderson. Oh, excellent diving stop. Now sending it in. Not away completely. Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Well, as the stats confirm, Liverpool had the lion's share of the ball, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Gakpo. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool. Has a go! And a crisp effort just over the top. Spurs to make a personnel switch now. a good Liverpool move in the making can he finish the importance of that tackle cannot be overstated and you don't want to lose possession there that is a tackle and a half now can they counter clinically Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. And a throw in for Liverpool. Into the final 20 minutes. 
Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Useful looking ball. And he couldn't quite muster a real threat. Son in the centre. Well, no damage done. Well, the counter chance looks very real. An incisive pass. Oh, that's a goal at the wrong end. Well, it's every defender's nightmare. An own goal here. Well, here it is again, and he's a bit unfortunate, you have to say. But it will count as an own goal against him, I'm afraid. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Skip. Perisic with the ball. Flag raised for offside. Substitution for Liverpool. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. To be replaced by number seven, James Milner. Mo Salah. And fine goalkeeping. Substitution for Tottenham Hotspur. Coming off the pitch, number four, Oliver Skip. Coming onto the pitch, number six, Davinson Sanchez. Substitution for Liverpool. Coming off the pitch. Time for a change then. Five, Coming onto the pitch, number two, Joe Gomez. And he's fired over the corner and clears his lines. And the counter attack is on, options available. All hands on deck. And Son! Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. It looks promising. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. As far as stoppage time is concerned, three minutes here. Longley. Dan Yuma. The sound of the referee's whistle, this match is in the history books and it goes down as a Liverpool victory. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Well, whatever way you look at it, a fine display from Trent Alexander-Arnold. What did you make of his contribution? Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.